Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Eric Guns of Idaho or Luis Outdoors. In today's video, we're going to be making a video with some of these pellet painters from Terminator, Air Guns and Outdoors. So we have two different molds or pellet trades um, and we are going to be painting some slugs and pellets in today's video. So I'm very excited about that. This is going to be the first time that I get to test these painting thingies. So I'm going to be pretty surprised with the results we get. So I'm very excited. So here we go. All right, guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and don't forget to support the people that support this channel. So Terminator Airguns and Outdoors is one of them, and also Idaho Airgun, and um, they have the online store now, so very happy about that. I'll put the links down below, so let's get into it. Here we go. All right, guys, so we are going to be painting some pellets or slugs today using the Terminator Airgun pellet painters, I would call them. So I got some slugs here that I have already painted. They look really nice. We're gonna go ahead and take them out of here and show you guys the results of the slugs, how they're painted. And we're also gonna go ahead and paint some some 30 cal pellets, as you can see. And also some 25 caliber pellets as well. So let me go ahead and show you the process. I'll show you guys the results that we are getting from the painters the painting thingies whatever so. all right so here are both of the slugs we took out these are the results um, I'm not really I'm not sure if you guys can see the difference between the paint um, this one here was sprayed with uh, the clear stuff some of this stuff here and it does look a little bit more shiny than these here I'm not sure if you guys can see the difference or not but there there it is really nice really nice so and it's pretty fast so let's go ahead and fill these things up with pellets so all you got to do is push them in here you can see put them in there it's pretty simple All right, guys, so after inserting all the pellets on the trays, we want to make sure the pellets are pushed down perfectly in here. Um, so when we go ahead and paint the pellets, um, there's no paint on the side of the pellet. So we only want to paint the very top of the pellets and slug. So you want to go ahead and make sure that you have pushed them in all the way, kind of, um, in well. So everything seems to be good. Now what we are going to be cleaning the bases with some alcohol I'm going to be using this because I do um, use lubricant to lube my slugs when I'm making them or switching the slugs so I want to go ahead and remove some of that oil from the very top so the spray paint can stay there for longer so yeah so let's go ahead and do that right now all right so I got this all soaked so we just want to go ahead and clean this out real quick just a little quick clean on everything here you guys you guys get the idea so let me go ahead and clean this well and then we'll continue all right guys so after the pellets have been cleaned and dried with alcohol we're gonna go ahead and paint them with a painter primer this is a white primer so let's go ahead and do that So there you go all right now that we have the slugs and pellets drying up with the primer on there let's go ahead and paint this with uh, some actual co colors now so this is orange let's see how it goes with orange first so here we go so there you go then let's switch it up to yellowish greenish all right 
there we go. All right, so basically the paint has dried now. So let's go ahead and spray some of this clear, shiny stuff on here. Uh, this should help make the pellets more shiny when the when they're flying in the air. So. All right, let's do that one and also this one here. There you go. And then we won't do these, just these two here. So I'm going to let them dry for a few minutes and then we'll come back and look at the results after that. As you can see here is the shininess here. And this one wasn't sprayed, so it's a little bit um not as shiny as these other ones here so there you can see the results here and also here as well with the sun